Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you six different websites that pay you around $100 per hour and these are some just kind of side hustles you can do for extra money. These aren't full time usually, but if you want an extra $100 or so per hour of your time on the side, here's some places to check out. So one is called tutsplus.com. You can go to code.tutsplus.com slash articles and look for the um, article writing page where you can actually submit articles. So if you know how to code and you have experience with things like PHP, Ruby, server-side JavaScript, HTML5, CSS3, etc., some kind of coding language, you can do tutorials and get paid $100 to $250 per tutorial that you get published here. So in many cases, you can make $250 or more from just getting one of these published. They even have some authors regularly bill them $700 plus per month on the side just publishing high quality tutorials for them you know, a few times per month. So they'll even tell you how to pitch these tutorials as well. But again, they accept articles on PHP, Ruby, server-side JavaScript, HTML5, CSS3, document-based database systems, other web development related topics and things like that. So. Uh, in-depth tutorials are $250. A shorter tutorial is usually about $100. So check out Write for Tuts Plus. Put that in Google and you should, up, should end up on this page here. I'll also have a link to this in the show notes. Another type of guest publishing site that you can do is called Great Escape Publishing. Now, obviously, there are a lot of different types of websites out there where you can do guest writing, guest tutorials, and get them published and you wanna just have a list of these that you're qualified to write for that you can get published at, and then you could do this on a monthly basis. And it shouldn't take you more than you know, an hour or two to write an article. And again, you can get paid a few hundred dollars per article in many cases. But another one to check out is greatescapepublishing.com. Here are the writer's guidelines if you wanna submit uh, articles here. This is a company that, showing that specializes in showing people how to get paid to travel so writing photography doing tours all that kind of stuff so if you're someone who's interested in traveling while making money or you have experience doing that you could write articles here on the side and get paid for it and again they'll even do 150 dollars for each one of them whether it's an interview personal story or articles that they request um, for different subjects related to what their audience is looking for again which is usually something related to making money while traveling around the world. Usually these only have to be 300 to 600 words long too. So you're talking $150 per article. It only has to be 300 to 600 words. That's something you can do in probably like 30 minutes. Another type of gig that you can get is by reading and using your voice for voiceovers. So you're literally getting paid to read some sort of script. So one place to do this is voices.com slash jobs. You can get paid to read all sorts of different types of scripts and things like that for whether it's a podcast, whether it's a character in some kind of you know, YouTube video, whether it's for uh, audiobook, different types of things. You can do it for ads. I mean, uh, $100, $250 for around 30 seconds or for reading maybe less than a page of script in many cases. So you're talking well over $100 per hour doing that. You also get paid via PayPal or via a check. You also get to create a guest membership for free as well. And when you click on voiceover services, you can see animation, educational, radio, voice assistant, telephone, internet video, audiobooks. You can get paid for doing any of these types of things. You just create an account here at voices.com and then you can work on getting hired. They even have a page at voices.com slash rates that tells you about how much you can make for finished minutes or word count. So you're talking 100 to 249 dollars for 300 words or less, 300 to 750 words, 250 to 499 dollars, and then you can just keep going from there. They have all sorts of different types of jobs on here and all you really do is read a script. You also have ACX, which is actually owned by Amazon, and this is a place where you can also earn around $100 an hour estimated, getting paid to read books and turn them into audiobooks. So if you're interested in this kind of thing, check out voices.com and check out acx.com. You can go to acx.com producer to create an account and 
start trying to get paid to read different types of audiobooks and things like that. So next you have something like focus groups. So there are focus groups out there that will literally pay you just to answer a few questions. Many of these will take an hour or less and usually you get paid upwards of a hundred or two hundred dollars for each one of these that you complete and you don't need a certain type of background for a lot of these some of these you do depending on what they're asking but for the most part you can also do these remotely from home as well a lot of times these were more in person but now since covid and since you know the internet has become so prominent they can do a lot of these with people from home so again you're a part of a focus group with something like respondent.io, you can get paid to do these mostly remotely. They're not as city specific as some other sites as well. So usually you can do these without having to live next to a certain city. You can also refer people as well. So when you create an account, you can get $50, 20 to $50 or so for each person that you refer to this program that completes a study. And then you can earn yourself an average of around $120 per hour. So looking at some of the projects on here, they have 704 projects available right now. So they'll tell you whether it's remote, they'll tell you how long this will take, they'll tell you when this was posted, and they'll tell you how much you'll get paid. Then they have a description and a question or some, type of, some sort of title. So if you're, if you're a developer, you can do this one. Headcount planning for department leads. You have medical care coordinators, case managers, medical care staff, I've seen some where they literally ask you about what your favorite laundry products are, or what your favorite you know, apparel is. You see this, seeking women who love online shopping for apparel. That reaches a lot of different people. Um, you have all sorts of things with just broad audiences, specific audiences for people with a certain type of job, etc. And again, you can sign up at respondent.io slash respondent. Another one like respondent that also pays you to literally participate in focus group studies is WatchLab. You can go to watchlab.com to sign up. Usually these are more city specific, so if you live near a major city, this would probably be more helpful for you. Um, they also do their posts on a Facebook page, so if you wanna check out what type of jobs are available in a, like a listings page, you can go and sign in or go to their Facebook page. And you can also get started as early as 16 years of age or older. Usually these, pays, these pay between 60 and $150 per hour averaging around $100 per hour. So when you sign up, just go to watchlab.com, click join our community, and then you'll fill out that form there. And then if you wanna to go to WatchLab on Facebook, you can see which ones they're posting right now. So you have one that pays $500. If you're in Portland and interested in a paid study about food, you have uh, another one that's nationwide about technology, pays $125. So literally you're just getting paid to answer questions. Paid study on cooking, $275 nationwide. So make sure you look and see where these are located as well. A lot of these are nationwide these days though. Some of these pay you really well. Some of these, you know, a lot of the ones on respondent are 100 to $200. Some of these on here, four or $500. So this is a, just another way that you can get paid to um, just spend a little bit of extra time every once in a while and what and make well over hundred dollars per hour So hopefully this was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe if you want more daily videos like this on making money online And I'll see you in the next video